Hello and welcome. My name is Allison Bream and I'm the CEO and founder of Virtual Corporate Wellness. In today's video, I want to talk about the number one thing that will kill your corporate wellness program if you don't address this before you start. And that is employee privacy. So as you know, your health your personal information, that's something that's very private and it should be kept that way. And I think a lot of times when it comes to corporate wellness, you know, a lot people think about, oh, you know, they're gonna they're gonna look at my, you know, health results and they're gonna assess where I'm at, or you know, they're gonna see that, you know, maybe I'm going to the doctor a lot and how is that going to impact my employment? And I think it's really, you know, it's a valid question, you know, that employees raise. But at the same time, it's your responsibility to squash those fears because, you know, when a corporate wellness is done right, it's really very transparent. The employees know exactly what you're doing, how you're tracking, and what you're going to be doing with that information. So you need to make sure that you are ACA and HIPAA compliant and making sure that any partners or vendors that you bring on board to come in and help you with your corporate wellness programs are taking employee privacy seriously. So I hope this quick tip helps and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And hop on over to my website at virtualcorporatewellness.com, sign up, uh, enter in your first name and your best email address, and we'll take it from there so we can continue the dialogue. Until then, take care, and I'll see you in the next video.